we wanted to digitize the pharmacies, the e-pharmacy. Ladies and gentlemen, patients or people generally face difficulties when trying to find medicines in pharmacies. They have no way of knowing which pharmacies have the drugs before they go. They could go to five pharmacies before they are lucky of finding the drugs. Sometimes patients are directed to go to specific pharmacies to buy the medicine, denying them any advantage there may be from choosing a lower price shop. People also don't know what the prices of the medicine at the different pharmacies are. And they are, in their time of vulnerability, they are just happy to pay whatever is asked at the pharmacy where they find the drug. It is also difficult to tell whether the medicines are genuine or fake. And there's also a drug abuse with uh, drugs such as uh, prescription drugs such as tramadol. To address this problem, government challenged the Pharmaceutical Society of Ghana to digitalize the operations of pharmacies in Ghana. Following this and working with the Pharmacy Council in collaboration with the private sector, I'm glad to say that we, that we have completed work on a digital platform for all pharmacies in Ghana. And currently, the pilot of 45 pharmacies is taking place. And basically, the e-pharmacy platform will offer the opportunity for everyone through a mobile phone to upload your prescriptions and find out which pharmacies near you have the medicines. Secondly, you can compare the prices of the same drug offered by different pharmacies. You, you can sit in your home, choose the pharmacy you want to buy the drug from, order it, pay for it, and it will be delivered in your home without you visiting the pharmacy. The e-pharmacy will also help us address the problem of drug abuse. Those who are prescribed the medicines, controlled medicines like tramadol, for example, will no longer receive a paper prescription. They will be sent a one-time code via SMS. And once the prescription is uploaded, and it will be used only once at the pharmacies. Thankfully, the e-pharmacy will be launched before the end of this year. And this will make Ghana, I'm so proud of this, this will make Ghana the first country in sub-Saharan Africa to have a national scale e-pharmacy and only one of the few countries in the world with a national scale e-pharmacy. I would like to thank the Pharmacy Council, the Ghanaian private partners for being very proactive in meeting the deadlines we have set them. 